into coffee in depth. We start at the farm and go all the way to the cup as a way to really focus on experiential learning. Do something that is important in industry, but it's hard to do. Explore the science and engineering of what we see in coffee and then link it to other aspects of engineering. Basic principles of wastewater treatment towards the production side of coffee. We get into the thermodynamics of how we make stable beans that won't rot in transport. Through roasting of the coffee, looking at reaction engineering, how we grind, what makes a good grinder, what makes a bad grinder, to brewing coffee. We have these Cafe Logic computer-controlled coffee roasters. They can change the profiles and the end reaction product. Here, we can do something and then immediately brew a cup of coffee and taste what we've done and we get immediate feedback. It was probably one of my favorite engineering classes I've ever taken because it applied to every day. You know, I drink coffee every single day. If I can get a job in the coffee industry as a coffee engineer, I would love to. And now we go to the judging. We have seven teams. One group will rise from each of those lab days. So in the finals, two student teams go up against Ply from Rogue Wave Coffee, one of Canada's most celebrated roasters, and who has been roasting the same coffee using the exact same equipment. It's the end of the day, can the students take on Ply? The grand winner of this tasting is Ply. <laughs>